Hello, Chile fans. Um, hope you enjoy the movie. Look forward to seeing it. <laughs> <laughs> it's really cute. <laughs> <laughs> On the surface, they're vampires, and those, and and then werewolves, and those are like the issues that they have to deal with. But but underneath that, they're human, and those are the real issues that they're struggling with. And I think they're just very relatable. And that, that's well, that's why the fans feel so attached and they're so passionate about the series. He left you, Bella. He didn't want you anymore. Oh, that's good. It's exciting. It's amazing to know we have that kind of fan support behind us. It makes me feel a lot more relaxed. Um, and you'd think that it would make you like more nervous and you'd have like more pressure, but... They're very supportive. Yeah. They're extremely supportive. So, they're, they're like the driving force behind us. It's, it's, it's amazing. But it's something like this? Not at all. No. No, no. This, this came as a total surprise. We didn't expect anything. So this is just like... Wow. No, I mean, I, I love Jacob's character. It challenges me um, a lot as an actor, which is, which is great. And uh, yeah, I think, I think people are going to be really pleased with the werewolves. She basically, in the beginning of the film, is dead. Like, she's, uh, a chunk is literally taken out of her. And she's strong enough to get that back without Edward coming back. Um, which really says something about there's a lot of like feminist issues with the book like oh she's so devoted to him blah 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 it's like yeah she's in love with him but but that's it takes a strong person to give yourself to someone and then once they leave remain be able to find yourself again and she finds herself again with the help of Jacob